Hello everyone. Um, I had been a late dinner again, so I was ridiculously hungry. That's why I already started making everything. And I just realised I need to record what I'm doing. So basically, oh, but anyway, I already started. So I just repeat what I have done again. Now, what I did was I cut eight tomatoes to a half and I cut one leg. The leg, you need to finely cut them because you need to infuse the tomato flavours. So they're cooking at the moment. There you go. Oh, they're cooking with a little bit of olive oil. And I forgot to tell you what I'm cooking today. I'm cooking a flour flake tomato soup. So the flake, we have just made it. It's like this. Later, you will bite them to little pieces and then they just look like a cornflake. Yeah, not cornflake, flour. Okay, and I have mixed two eggs together. There you go. It's just a normal procedure. And this food is very nutritious, has a lot of nutrition in there. And um, it's a very traditional food from North China. And yeah. It's quick to make, five, six minutes, maximum ten minutes, you will get everything done. So, right, I'm just softening the tomato at the moment and it probably take about five or six minutes. Okay, now, um, the tomato is already like, most of them already softened and I have add a little bit of water just to give them a puree look like. And if I want to have a look, there you go, it looks like this. So. Tomatoes leak with a bit of water. The next one. And what you really want is a very smooth mixture. Okay, now, and um, it's quite a smooth mixture now. So it looks like this. I don't know whether you can see very well. It looks like this. Anyway, so now, a lot of people don't want to leave their skin on. I do because. It has a lot of rich fibers and vitamin C's on the skin, so that's why I really like to leave the skin on. Now, and just to increase the flavor, I do add a little bit of tomato puree. So just a bit, not much. I got a new one. Right, there you go. About two cm of tomato puree. Okay, and mix them together. Okay, now we can add a now we can add a flake. Now when you add a flake, it's always good to be, to bite them to little pieces. So I use to my hand with water, so nothing really fancy. It's real flavor food. It's better in this because you want to get a better texture of the flake. And then we just need to mix them together. Um, wait for few, probably three minutes time in medium heat, they will be done. Okay. Minutes we can add. Now after two three minutes, the flake already cooked properly. So what we need to do now is add an egg. After we add an egg. Give a pinch of here. You have a sour flavor, so just give it a bit salty now. And you will look at a goopy mixture. That's what we want. Okay. Now just coat the egg uh, in about one two minutes, and then this dish is done. Okay, now the dish is done actually. I just give you a final look of how the dish looks like in the pan, okay? So it's quite eggy and goopy, okay? So that's how it looks like, okay? Now, you just need to put that on the serving bowl. After you put that on the serving bowl, just give a bit of the lemon zest. From half a lemon actually, not a whole lemon. Okay, so 
here is the front. Yeah, I hope you enjoy it. It's a real comfort food, full of nutrition, easy to make and quick. If you want a quick dinner, that's what you should go for. Right.